if I could go back to kindergarten, I would tell my younger self that you have so much to look forward to. During these next 12 years, you're gonna be able to develop and explore your interests. One thing that really helped prepare me for college was being able to take college level courses while I was still in high school through programs like AP and dual enrollment. Uh, it allowed me to complete all my college core classes while I was still in high school and just helped me adjust to the environment before I actually got to college. Something I've learned from high school is to overcome obstacles and try new things, and even if I don't succeed, I would still learn something from each experience. I feel that a lot of the teachers and counselors I had helped me prepare for college level classes by giving me advice and helping me pick which dual enrollment classes to take in high school. Also, I feel that a lot of the teachers and counselors I had helped me figure out what I wanted to do after high school. I'm super excited to graduate, like this has been the quickest four years ever and I'm ready to start a new chapter, further my education, meet new people and just experience another whole another environment. I was very shocked when we first went into Miss Clayton's office. I had no idea what I was in there for, thought I was in trouble. Um, but she was talking about a scholarship, and I was like, oh my. I didn't think that I would get picked. So I was very shocked, but I'm thankful for it. The advice that I would give the REACH scholars that are following my footsteps is, don't just do enough to get by. Take the extra steps to be, to exceed. I will be attending Valdosta State, majoring in health science, with a minor in dance to later become a double certified athletic trainer and physical therapist. My thoughts and feelings about going, graduating and going to college is a bit nerve-wracking and I'm also a bit sad. It's nerve-wracking because I'm excited to leave. I'm excited to be free and be an adult. But I'm a bit sad because COVID kind of stripped half my graduation and half my senior year. But that just means we're a stronger class, so. Completing school is a big accomplishment. Um, being an honor graduate feels amazing, and also being able to go to school on a track and field scholarship also feels amazing. A few people that helped me along the way were Dr. David Slad, Dr. Rune Slad, Mr. Chuck Puckett, and Mr. Mateen. I will forever be grateful for all of their help and support. There was definitely some times where, you know, I had to maybe put a, put a, put in a little more effort than I was giving, than what I was sometimes wanting to give, you know, because it, it, it hits you, you know, it's like you got to do certain things to accomplish certain obstacles. If I can give a ninth grader advice, I would probably say that at the beginning, definitely make sure that you stay on top of your work and grades because the closer you get to the, your senior year, it's gonna seem like it's going like super fast. So make sure you stay on top of everything from the beginning. So that way when you get to the end, you won't have to try to start bringing up GPAs or anything along those lines. It is very important at the start of your high school to make sure you you know, have a good understanding of like what classes are gonna help you and that type of thing like that. So I would say to stay ahead of like, you know, the game. But when I first became a Reed Scholar, I was very ecstatic. I was so overwhelmed with joy that I had been given this opportunity to help me with what I wanted to do later on in life. And I can't bless anyone but God for that opportunity. After I graduate, I want to go to school 
at Georgia College and State University to major in biology to become a veterinarian. say, you know, thank you to all my friends and family and, you know, Dr. Salaz, the staff of Early College, the staff of Ball County the School District, you know, they really helped me a lot to uh, be where I am now. You know, obtaining a, a social degree out of high school, you know, that's a big accomplishment for me. And I just want to say thanks to all them, thanks to everybody.